After almost a decade, the women's NCAA tournament is coming back to the University of Colorado. For the 2013 tournament, the school will be able to be a part of the Magic as Coors Event Center will be one of 16 college arenas hosting rounds one and two of the tournament. Basketball fans know that the most exciting point of the tournament may just be in the first two rounds when Cinderella stories are made, when an underdog beats a powerhouse or when a scrappy little guard shoots her small school into the next round. No matter a school's regular season record, all teams will be coming to Coors Event Center to give it their all. However, excited CU students wanting to be a part of the action are confused about the price of tickets as well as how and where to get them. If it's like a one session pass and you're getting three, four or five games out of it, I think probably 15, 20 bucks would be a fair offer. I think the affordable price for the first session would be like $12 maybe. I, I guess the Coors Event box office? Uh, probably the UMC or the box office at the Coors Event. CU will be offering three different ticket packages for different age groups. The session one ticket package includes two round one games. The session two ticket package includes the one round two game and the all-session ticket package includes all three games being held at Coors Event Center. For more information about pricing or to buy tickets, a fan can go to the CU box office at Folsom Field or go to the ticket page on cubuffs.com. In the early 2000s, we were a staple of hosting the NCAA tournament, um, and it's really an opportunity for the university to showcase itself on a national level, uh, bring in new fans, bring in business to the city of Boulder, and of course it just gives our, our student athletes a terrific opportunity uh, to play one more time in front of their court, um, front of, on their home court in front of their fans. The CU women's basketball team is currently ranked 19th and finished their regular season on a nine-game winning streak. Some students believe that if the Buffs are placed in the bracket plan at Coors Event Center, that the school should offer some kind of discounted ticket plan for students wanting to be one of the 11,000 fans attending this year's game. I really think it would be a good idea for CU to give students a discount if this, the women's basketball team are placed in the bracket that would allow them to play here at Coors Event Center. I think we should either get a discount or at least get first pick on getting tickets. Like we should at least get tickets first since we're the fans. It, you know, we certainly value having as many of our students as we can. We've seen throughout the men's and women's games this year what a valuable asset they are. And so we certainly want students to attend. So I don't have any uh, thing to announce right now, but I know that something could be in the works for to uh, entice students to come to the games. So you will find out which teams they will be hosting in the 2013 NCAA Women's Basketball Tournament on Selection Monday, March 18th. Reporting for News Team Boulder, I'm Nate Durant.